This is calculator question number 21 on the April 2019 SAT. College Board gives us a picture of a mark on the side of the tire of a car and a description of the situation in which this car accelerates from rest and the graph represents the height of the mark above the ground as the car is accelerating. And we have to visualize this situation carefully and First of all, the mark is not at the very edge of the tire. The mark will never actually touch the ground as the tire rotates, if you look at the picture carefully. So choice B, where the mark touches the ground, would not be correct. Choice C shows the mark going forward and backward, but as the car accelerates, the tire is always moving forward, and the mark will also always move forward. So cho choice C is not correct. The question is, is the height of the mark above the ground a zigzag like choice D or is it a curve where the waves get closer together like choice A? Since the car is accelerating, we expect the motion of the mark to be compressed as the car accelerates and also if you look at the height of this mark, as the, car, as the mark rotates through its top point, the height of the mark is changing comparatively slowly and the same when the mark is near the ground. And that has to do with the graph of the sine, as in the trig function sine of t, or sine of a constant times t. So we would expect A and not D. The mark will not zigzag. If you watch a bicycle with a reflector or visualize a bicycle with a reflector, you may be able to visualize what this looks like. In any case, College Board often asks you to visualize the graph of a situation they describe in a word problem. So practice this skill and make sure that this answer makes sense. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.